All right, here is my favorite panther chameleon. Don't tell my other panther chameleons this. <laughs> <laughs> they brought him in for what they thought was an abnormal behavior, which I haven't seen yet. So it could still be abnormal. I just haven't seen it. Something about the eyes puffing out. Um, oh, big blink. Well, that's not puffing out. That's just a big blink. Um, Dr. That was it, though? Yes. That was exactly it? Okay, so that's not puffing out. That'd be more like puffing in. Okay, so what we just saw in that right eye was it turns out that the two little lids that you see on the outside, okay, or the external, you know, like your eyelids that you have, they also have a third eyelid on the inside called a nictitans that can actually cover it, okay? Mm -hmm. So what happens is as their eyes get dry, they can actually use that nictitan membrane to come up and cover the whole thing. But it's because their eyes are so big, the eyes got to pop in some for that, that membrane to cover it. When frogs do the same thing, it's like their eyes just disappear. It's really funny how their, their head gets flat where the big bulbous eye used to be. Okay, so that's actually pretty normal. But doing that more frequently could be a cause of some, could be from conjunctivitis or something like that. Um, at this point in time, because you guys already had that antibiotic at home, the eye drops, let's go ahead and use that for a few days and let's see if that decreases it. But what you'll need to do for the rest of the day for you at home is try to count how many times he does that. It's going to okay. sound strange. Yeah. But if you were to count, say, for example, 20 times in an hour, then we know that average might be 20 times in an hour. And when you put your eye drops in there, then after a day or two of use, if it goes down to once an hour or twice okay. an hour, then we know the treatment is working. Okay. Okay. The, the, the rubbing, would that be... And a... hopefully the rubbing will be something okay. that'll go, that'll be, uh, go away as well. Okay. All right. Go ahead, reach for the camera. I know you want to do it. Do the whole thing. I want camera. Mm -hmm. Okay. The ghost wanted in. Yeah. <laughs> hey, no. What? What? Your utter handsomeness. All right, cool. We have a plan. Later, dude. Adjust. He doesn't want to cooperate. Look at that. Well, he's not even opening his left eye over here. Yeah. But his right eye is open looking around. Okay. Now so that that makes sense. If you're, you know, your eyes are a little irritated, then you're having some some light sensitivity. You know, you, mm -hmm. bright lights are an issue. And this guy's not opening his left eye, which is funny because you guys have been telling me it's his right eye that's been doing the the puffy thing. It's casually both. Yeah, it'll it'll be both. But she said that was the right one today. I caught him doing his left one this morning. Okay. But he does do. You guys still have some eye drops? Mm -hmm. Okay. We just did a big blink. It was third eyelid without even opening his outside eyelid. So there's definitely something going on in there. In that left eye? Yeah. The left eye is what he was rubbing against this morning. Look how dark he's looking. You are one handsome lizard. Good dude. I like this kid. He's getting some red in. No. <laughs> See, that, this is exactly what he'll do. And he'll go and hide under one of the leaves and get out of the light. Okay. See, what that's, I'm glad we took him outside. I didn't even think about that because I thought he was hiding just to, to hide. But no. That's probably what it is. Just 
what the bulge looked like. Oh, we opened it. Got it open. You see how he's kind of in the corner? <laughs> All right, we'll get you back inside. He's like, dude, this light stuff is awesome. Okay, we're going back inside. You ready? He's doing like it's cold in there. No, don't take me inside. Don't do it. Don't do it! Huh?